Hey everyone, and welcome to another SEO tutorial. This is actually a follow-up to the Facebook issue of not being able to see uh, reviews and recommendations, more than just the first three or four. And I apologize for the size of the text on the screen, but it's, it's on purpose. It's to show you to see what the issue is. So here we are on a Facebook business page, and we're on the Reviews tab, and we notice that down here, Right, we don't see more of the reviews. And we could scroll way down and we still don't get to see any more. So we only see the first three in this case. All right, so what's the workaround for this? How can we actually see this? Well, the, the simplest way to solve this is right up here. And I'll go ahead and zoom in a bit. Okay, zooming in here on the same page, we see here's this drop down for most helpful. And if we switch this, right, we just drop the, click the drop down and change it. Right, to most recent. Now it doesn't seem like it's done anything, but it's actually reloaded the page. Now, hold on, I'll zoom back out. Okay, now we see, and I apologize for the blurring, but now we see that we can see the reviews, not just the first three, but all these down below. And if we scroll down, we can see that we can actually see them all. So they are visible. So the other thing that's good about this, another good workaround, is that we're only seeing these blocked when we are logged in as the manager or as the owner of the page. So if we are, let's just say the public, then we can see all the reviews and recommendations. So I'll go show you how that looks. Okay, so here we are on the, the same Facebook business page and I apologize for the blurring, but you'll get the idea here. So not only are we not logged in at all, that means we're also not the the manager or the owner of this page. Now we're on the same Facebook business page, on the same reviews tab, we're simply not logged in. When we do that, and we're on the reviews page, we can see all the reviews. It's a nice workaround in that if we need these reviews, if we need to go in and make copies of them, we need to use them in some other way, we can still get to them. And that's two different ways. Right? We just showed you for these workarounds. One is to not be logged in as the owner nor as the manager. And the other one is to go to the actual page and click the top so that it goes from the set most helpful to most recent. Right? That reloads the page and it seems to trick Facebook into showing all of the reviews. Thanks, and I hope this helps as a workaround. Even though it really doesn't solve the problem, it allows you at least to be able to still get in there and look at your reviews. Again, I would just go ahead and recommend that you go in there and make a copy of them so that you have them just in case they get lost or something happens to the page. You have a copy of all your reviews and recommendations. All right, if you need any help, you can always come over to BT Foom and contact us. Hope you enjoy this. You can always subscribe and hit the notification bell if you'd like to get another great Tuesday tutorial. Thanks, and I hope this helps.